Hey everybody, it's Katrina. Today I'm going to show you how to make a zombie paracord bracelet. To zombify your paracord bracelet, you can do it by either weaving through an accent cord on a cobra weave or doing a whole bracelet out of the zombie cord. This one was made with the method I'm going to show you today, which is with a razor blade, and this one was just made with a household scissors. Another thing you can do with this zombie cord is take an existing bracelet that you've made and weave an accent cord through, or if you want to make a whole bracelet out of it like we've done with these two, you can do any kind of weave with it as well. So what you're going to need to make your zombie cord is a few strands of gutted cord. Today I'm using 750 for the outer cord and 550 for the inner cord. You can use 550 for both, it's just a little bit more time consuming. Um, you're going to need a scissors, a razor blade, a lighter, and then also I have a medium sized fit that I've already attached to the inner strand. So to begin all you're going to do is cut off the amount that you want um, I just have about a foot section here and then you're going to attach the medium sized fit to the inner strand that you want and just weave it through the outer sheath. So as you can see it really doesn't take that much time especially if you're using 750 for the outside. So I'm just going to cut off the ends and then melt them together so you don't have any fraying. All right, now comes the fun part. What you're gonna do is you're gonna lay it flat. Um, you're gonna take your razor blade and just you just have to barely scratch the surface of the cord with the tip of the razor blade. And then you're going to use your nail and just scratch it up until it starts to fray. So you can continue one cut at a time or you can make multiple cuts and just fray up the cord and then go back and use the lighter. So I just made three cuts here. Okay, so you're going to take your lighter and you're going to put the blue flame near the cord so that it starts to melt away the outer cord and expose the inside like that. You'll do that down the hole and you'll see that the cord will start just peeling itself away kind of from the from the fraying that we did. And then you get that kind of a look. So then we'll continue to do that throughout the rest of the cord. So here is your completed piece of zombie paracord and what you can do with a small piece like this is put it into a cobra bracelet as an accent cord such as this one. If you don't know how to do this, down below we'll list a link to the thin blue line pictorial that we have. Um, another option you could do is do a whole bracelet out of it and what we did for this one is we took about eight feet of coyote brown and wove through imperial red so the same way we did this smaller piece. Um, made the bracelet and then it looked something like this, like a normal cobra. And then we did the same process of using the blade and the lighter on the top of the bracelet only so that way the bottom is still smooth and it won't scratch your skin and we will leave a link down below as well to a cobra tutorial. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, you can leave them for us down below. Give us a like, subscribe to our channel, otherwise that's all for now. See you later!